All right, winner's round two. We got Android versus Fat Kid. Winner goes on to play the winner of Joel versus Hornet. 13-man tournament today with only two DQs so far. Spin is the only invader with Joel being the favorite for representing Siwa. Android potentially another player that could be doing that. Uh, but we shall see who ends up representing them. Uh, upsets, yeah, Warm Day Beanie ended up beating Skitsu earlier in this bracket, which is kind of crazy. Only kind of crazy. Not, like, super, super crazy. But anyways, yep, yeah, we got a matchup for Fat Kid versus Android. Ness and Wii Fit Trainer should be an interesting one. I don't know when the last time these guys played was. I feel like these guys play somewhat often, but I could be wrong about that. I don't care to learn the stats for online results off the top of my head. Right, hits him with the forward air. Got an even game so far. So Android did clean it out against um, Chichone earlier in the bracket, but uh, actually had some close games. Both of them last stock. And we'll see who edges it out this time. Even game right now. Let's see who takes the first stock. DK Fire gets the up smash out of it. I like his decision to go for that instead of the grab since he doesn't need it to kill. The up smash is safer in case he like mashes out of the fire. I like that. <laughs> Hits him with a forward smash on the overextension. I like that. Up air barely not killing. Uses the up air to get back. So one thing that Android's going to have to watch out for... Um, and it's working so far against Fat Kid. I guess one thing that Fat Kid could start calling out more so um, than Android having to watch out for is uh, Android loves going for very aggressive recoveries back to the stage, using the up air or the forward air or just air dodging in. Right, uh, very rarely going to ledge. Right, you see like that that air dodge right there that he just did. And a big, um, I mean, it's scary with Ness. You got a lot of very good aerials um, and a very hard to punish air dodge, but you can do stuff about that. And uh, one key to winning, I think, for Fat Kid will be calling those out and actually not letting him get away with that. Gets the grab there. Forward throw isn't going to kill. Unfortunate for Fat Kid's sake. Android um, living at 200%, but he finally takes the stock with the forward tilt. All right. Decent percent lead right now from Android, but certainly not anything unrecoverable. And I like the thunder there. Prevents him from being able to safely get a deep breathing up. Fat Kid ended up having to cancel, actually. And I think one thing, Android sort of uh, more aggressive uh, style in general, I think is very good for Wii Fit Trainer, particularly. Just not letting them have the opportunity to get the deep breathing charge up, which is kind of the win condition for Wii Fit Trainer, to be honest with you. Not entirely, but it's certainly a key component of that uh, character's toolkit, and it becomes a lot more annoying once you're unable to get that, um, get the maximum possible uptime on that. Android taking the stock there with an up smash. Got a full stock lead right now, and uses the PK fire, the active hitbox there, or the active thing, you know, it goes through the, like, the fire explodes, right, and he still has the iframes, but it hits him as soon as the iframes are over. There's a very smart PK fire there. Finally gets a deep breathing up, Fat Kid does. Nair, ooh, misses the tech, but Android a little bit uh, too slow on the jab lock. Nair's out of shield. Gets a forward air. Could be the end. It's a PK fire and it reflects the soccer ball back. Thunder. What's the edge guard? Another thunder. It's not gonna hit. Oh, it does actually. Down smash on the ledge, but good use of the soccer ball to get back there. Hits him with a back air. Tries to snipe him with the soccer ball. Doesn't work out. Goes for the YOLO down air. Hmm. I really dislike those down airs generally. I feel like you want to actually force them to recover low first. Okay, gets the forward tilt. Barely misses the soccer ball. See, again, like, he actually forces the recovery low there, but doesn't go for the down air. And it's a lot harder to hit online to see that when, or to recognize when you can, but, like, that's when you have to do those. Um, 
spike edge guards and good catch on the air dodge hits him with the up smash and android uh, taking the game with a two stock and off stream joel wins 2-0 over hornet Apologies for the lack of commentary. Alright, back to the match. <clears throat> Battlefield counterpick uh, a little bit late into this one. And a little bit of a lead right now from Fat Kid, actually. Surprising. Very good, uh, I don't know. Apparently something happened. What a sun reflect dodge. Wowzer, Johnny says. I'm curious what he's talking about, but apparently it was good for Fat Kid. Still, even in the stock count right now, so. And from what it sounds like, Fat Kid's still having a hell of a time getting a deep breathing up. Ooh, as I say that, though, he finally gets one. And takes the stock with it, that forward tilt. <laughs> very, very strong. Get some healing though from the sal salutation. Fair chains? Alright. Shit, we chic now? Or Mewtwo? Or other characters with fair chains? I <laughs> Ness? <laughs> huh. I didn't think of that. It's probably the one I should have said. Um, anyways. Fat Kid almost lapping Android in percent. Android are going to have to pull something out to actually get this game here. Ooh, almost catches him with the up air. Would have been very nice to get that. The dash attack sends him off stage. Recovers high though, Fat Kid again preemptively covering low without trying to force it. Like, Fat Kid could be doing so much better if he just worked on the recovery or the edge guarding a little bit. And actually started covering high and not just exclusively covering uh, low. It's like he covers low, but only when covering low isn't going to work. But, you know, gets the ledge drop, catches the forward smash, and we're going to game three. 
Let's do some jackknife exercises. I don't want to do jackknife exercises. All right. different fucking arena song after this. <sighs> Curious to see whether or not there will be any character counterfeit. Does not look like it. Let's see what the stage is, though. Johnny written for Fat Kid in chat. Small Battlefield is the counterpick. I can certainly understand the logic behind this one. Give him even less potential to get the deep breathing up. Very claustrophobic. I feel like Wii Fit Trainer wants space more than Ness does. Especially because Ness can be in your face a little bit more with these aerials. It's the up tear into the upper drag down into the up tilt, but no extension off of the up tilt. I don't know if up tilt's the right choice to go for there. I mean, it works, but. Oh. I actually didn't know you could shield grab through that. That's crazy. Wow. I don't... Yeah, I don't know how that charge hitbox works. I thought it was so fast that you couldn't, but... Apparently not. You learn new stuff every day, I suppose. Now I will never do that against an S. Although I might try not be out with Bowser. The shield grab? It's 10 frames, right? What is it on shield? Alright, even game still. The forward air off of the deep breathing, and the soccer ball almost taking the stock. I guess you could have called it a stalker ball. Huh? That was a terrible joke. Anyways, Fat Kid has the lead, but the PK Thunder into up air classic. The Wi Fi edge guarding. Coming in clutch for Android, keeping himself in this. Tied up. And we have some uh, interesting attempts to communicate via Morse code by pressing down rapidly on the uh, joystick. I can't think of what else that could possibly be. I guess, like, Shield Guy probably wouldn't work, like, on that one because he was spaced far enough away. Up smash. Probably not the choice one to go for. He was really counting on catching a jump. Still, even game. Still, though, I think, um... Something about the way momentum is going. I just feel like Fat Kid's in the lead right now, even though he's offstage. It's like, Fat Kid just seems, like, a lot more comfortable than he did in the first game. Step smash. Gets out of it. Throws it on the soccer ball. Alright. Despite what I said earlier, Android has uh, been firmly dictating the pace of this match for the last 40 seconds now. Uh, but despite all his best efforts, he's been unable to kill Fat Kid off of any of these interactions, and especially if Fat Kid just retaliates like that, taste the sun. Another sun salutation. He's off stage. Forced a low recovery, and that's gonna be it. And Fat Kid wins 2-1 over Android. 
stimulate 